uh, here we are again, sports fans. Uh, we are now putting the top half main bearing shells in the engine. Now this is a a 351 Windsor out of a uh, Ford van, which used to be mine, and I wrecked. Anyway, I saved the motor, and here we are. Uh, you weren't drunk when you wrecked it. No, no. And matter of fact, the uh, cameraman was with me. Anyway, no alcohol. What we're involved. doing, <laughs> what we're doing is you could see these two holes here. Now this hole, the small hole, direct feeds the cam bearing from the main bearing. Now the main bearing hole is the big one, goes through the block, you can see the, the, the passage here, a little bit of casting, goes down into this hole here. Or this hole, uh, no wait a minute. Pick a one of them is hydraulic, yeah, I don't know. One of these holes. Anyway, and that, the pump, which is bolted on here, feeds oil through here, around the filter, through here, back into the main passage here, and then through here to the main gallery. And I'm not sure where that is. So anyway, and, and, well, no, wait a minute. Here it is here. It's going here, over to here, down to here. And it feeds the lifters, then it feeds the main bearings. And what we're going to do is, in order to get the most amount of oil we can get to the main bearings, we want to free up any restriction. The restriction you could see is right here. So what we're going to do is take a Dremel with a fine carbide cutter. We're going to take a scribe and mark a little half moon doggy here. And then we're going to carefully cut the bearing out, deburr it, and we're going to do it with all five upper main bearing shells. Now the deal here is the upper main bearing shells mainly distribute oil through this groove coming from this hole to the crankshaft which is drilled for the rod bearings. Now to get more oil you can order fully grooved uh, main bearing shells. We have chosen to use the stock setup which is grooved on the top half and the, the bottom half you can see here is solid. And it goes in the cap. So we've chosen to use the stock main bearing setup. We're using ARP studs, which are much better than uh, than the stock bolts. And uh, that's where we're at now. We have Junior Here's Hillbilly. Our little Liam Junior, who's going to be the next engine builder. He's three, and he's already getting greasy like a monkey. <laughs> hey, buddy. Look at say, again. say Look Ford again. Stroker Power. Ford Stroker. Ford Stroker Power. <laughs> <laughs> All right, tune in next time, Hillbilly. Okay.